Hello and many thanks for joining me, Elvis, for yet another Somerset Real Ale review. Got here another beer from the uh, Sainsbury's Great British Beer Hunt 2013. This is from the Maxim Brewery. It's their American Pride. I've never heard of this brewery before. It's an India Pale Ale, 5.2% ABV. I'm guessing this is going to be a really good sort of American style IPA. Although at 5.2%, it's quite low, but. I had the, um, oh, from the brewery in Cornwall, I've forgotten the name of it, I do apologise. Uh, there was a brewery, a uh, Cornish brewery, um, they, they had a, uh, an IPA and that was fantastic, so this could be good. It, yes, like I said, 5.2% ABV, brown 500ml bottle, let's crack it. In. Incidentally, these beers are £1.50 each, plain background. So, you know, they're such a bargain, even if they're not spectacular. Although I don't tend to buy a lot of beer from supermarkets, I couldn't resist buying these beers. Um, it's not really pouring that much like an American IPA. You would expect a little bit more sort of body with it. Um, it's not a bottle condition, it's completely clear, absolutely see through. It's got a kind of orange tinge, so you know, it looks, yeah, orangey amber loads of carbonation in there but it's the clarity which gets me normally an IPA has got a little bit more you know sediment in it but um, not to worry it might be brilliant hardly any bubbles but they are just off white newspaper coloured let's get a nose in it now to me that smells like an English IPA you've got a sort of fruity character but you've got like a slight sort of orangey undertone citrusy orange it's um, a slight bit of spice in there, cinnamon or something like that. It smells nice, but it does not smell like an American IPA. It smells like an English IPA. I'm just going to dig into it and see what happens. Cheers everyone. Yeah. And it's fruity, mildly citrus, nice little bit of a sweet malt backbone in there, definitely not an American IPA. But it's a good English IPA. The name is just very deceiving. Um, Double Maxim Beer Co Limited, Halton Le Spring, no idea where that is. www.maximbrewery.co.uk. I didn't actually look this brewery up because I, I have no idea where that place is. Um, Maxim Brewery can trace its history back over 100 years. American Indie Pale Ale has been specially selected of one of the new craft beers that Maxim Brewery produces that can now be enjoyed from the bottle. Pardon me, I'm, I'm burped yet. I feel a burp coming on. Sorry. Um, <coughs> sorry, there it is. Um, American Pride is a strong IPA brewed using a combination of special American hops to make a perfectly modern drinkable ale, but one that gives a bitter nose and a dry mouth fill on the palate. I do realise that's <laughs> just ridiculous. I apologise for burping before I burp. Sorry, it's made me laugh. Um, yeah, I mean, it's a nice beer, but it's definitely not. I, I, I don't know, I mean, it, it, it sort of suggests that it's going to be an American style IPA, which it isn't. It is, however, like I've said it before, it's a nice English IPA. Um, it's very fruity. It's very, it's mildly citrusy. It's well balanced. You can taste there's a decent punch of alcohol in there, um, but not overpowering. Um, it's not a bad beer. I'm, I, I'm, <laughs> to be honest, I am enjoying it. I'm just a little bit disappointed with the name, but um, either way, it's going to get a seven out of ten because it, it's, it's a good beer. 
Uh, I would definitely drink it again if it was on cask. I'd be happy to drink that for you know three or four pints of that. Quite happy. Um, just thought it'd be an American style IPA, which it isn't. Thanks for watching me. Love to see your comments in the comments box down there. Hopefully you'll join me soon for another review. Cheers.